Well, right now we're taking a look at how this pandemic is affecting some of the Bay Area's most vulnerable children, those in the foster care system. ABC Action News reporter Lauren Mazella shows us some of the struggles that they're having as we start this new school year. With the pandemic, it's getting even more challenging for these foster families to take on additional kids. Some are telling caseworkers the responsibility of either supervising e-learning is just too much, or they have a high-risk family member who can't risk exposure by sending foster children back to in-person classes. Janet Rinaldi is the director of family advocacy of the West Florida Foster Care Services. She says many of the licensed foster families just don't have the means to help kids with learning delays or special needs. It's one thing to ask people to take kids into their home, you know, and, and be a foster parent. It's a whole nother level to ask them to also become their teachers and monitor their schoolwork. To try and help support these families, the West Florida Foster Care Services and other nonprofits have been working to deliver meals and school supplies. They also have this Amazon wish list where you can help. We have a link to that on ABCActionNews.com. Just click on our Safely Back to School section.